17 men in trouble with the law tonight, caught up in a prostitution sting led by the Fairfield County Sheriff's Office. Some of the suspects could be people you know, people who work with young people in our communities. Isabel Hansen working on this developing story. Isabel, what can you tell us about those now facing charges? Station Bob deputies arrested a local pediatric dentist and a Columbus State professor to point out a few of the suspects. The sheriff tells me it's concerning to see who's looking for this type of service. Or don't try to buy sex in Ohio. A simple message from the Fairfield County Sheriff after a complicated sting operation. These 17 people busted for paying for sex. Because we use the frequently visited uh, websites where these type ads go up. Uh, we create an ad, we put it up, and they respond to it. And through the offline then communication that goes on, uh, they make an arrangement to meet up. But little did these men know, they'd meet a female sheriff's deputy. These guys are going there uh, uh, with the hope that they're going to get what's been advertised to them and not knowing that it's a law enforcement officer that they're actually chatting with. The sheriff says the stings took place last Friday and the Friday before at hotels in Canal Winchester and Lancaster. Initially, when we first started doing this, I was kind of shocked to see the, the um, professions of some of the folks that are uh, responding to these ads and, and looking to obtain these type services. For example, this time they arrested a pediatric dentist, 56-year-old Ronald Griffin from Lancaster. According to the state's dental board, his license remains active right now. And this man, 60-year-old Rui Bruce, who the sheriff says works as a professor for Columbus State. On the college's website, he's listed as faculty under physical sciences. This particular activity uh, is a piece or a part of a broader uh, crime organization. The sheriff says with stings like this one, he hopes to decrease human trafficking in our area. If you could imagine pulling up you're traveling, you're staying at this hotel at a particular, at no place in particular. It's probably going on at that hotel that you're staying at because we can see that it's just like normal business that's occurring on a regular basis. I reached out to Columbus State earlier today and asked about the professor arrested in the sting. I'm waiting to hear back. You can find the full list of suspects names on our website. Just look for this story. Live on your side, I'm Isabel Hansen, Fox 28 News. Thank you, Isabel.